with George Oliphant from George to the Rescue, helping us with a special uh, design drew over on spackling. And he's teaching us how to empower ourselves and take business into our own hands. Exactly. Yes. You can do it. Everyone can do it. Which is not hard. Okay, so before the break, we backed. We spackled, yep. we scraped, mm -hmm. we let it dry. Now what do we do? Okay, so now what you're gonna do is you would sand where, the, where, your, where your repair is, sand okay. it all down. This is gonna dry, it sands off really nicely, you get it nice and smooth. And then after you sand it, you're going to, uh, you're gonna prime it. <laughs> Bravo. Bravo. Beautiful, beautiful. Like a pro. Thank you. Then you prime it. Okay. Um, so it's already actually, so these I think have already been primed. This one's oh. definitely been primed. This one is not, but that's all right. Okay. Yeah. The importance to priming, that is a very important step. A lot of times people will skip the priming step. Do not do that because if you ever notice you're sitting in a room and you look at a wall and even though it's all the same color, you can see that there was once a patch there. Yeah. That's because somebody didn't prime it. That's called flashing. Uh. And so if you prime it, that way the paint will all adhere equally to your repair and to the wall. I, I haven't been primed? Well, uh, no, that looks like there's a little prime on there. There's some prime on there. The I've been primer. Prime. Primer. You have prime. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys, anybody here ever paint without priming? I'm so guilty of it, because I'm like, paint it white, what? And then paint, is that double the work? Well, there's a lot of options that there's some compounds come with primer in it. Okay. Some paints come with primer in it, but it's always a good idea to prime it. And then, yes, you just roll it out. Now, there's times where you can use a brush, and there's times where you want to use a roller. When you're on a wall, you want to use a roller. It's going to give you a much more even finished product. That way you don't get like brush marks or anything. Mm. Brushes are great, obviously, if you're working in corners or if you're working on trim or book, bookshelves or something like that. This but so for this satisfying. wall, yeah. And then just roll it out. Wait, wait, this is exactly what I look like, too. But uh, look at that. I would give it maybe one more coat. We're going to let it dry and then get it with a second coat. And I am uh, so uh, inspired. Oh, no, no, my second uh, coat's not uh, going That's all right. Well. That's all right. You're good. You're good. Uh -uh. Don't press too hard. Let the, let the tool do the work. That's another problem. Sometimes with people with rollers, they push real hard. Let the roller just roll. And you'll uh, be good to go. That way you don't get roller marks, oh, you don't get brush marks. What do you do to get paint on your blazer? Oh, oh no! Yeah. Oh, That's a whole no. different oh, type of rescue. Drew's so excited, you can take this out. Oh God, I, let me get it, let me add it. <laughs> Let me add it, don't touch it. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Um, well, gosh, George, everything I do is like way too much and I did No, no, really no, you did great, you did fantastic. All right, is it okay? I, I, I will he, say we learned so much today. It's, I can't even see the repair. You fix it, it's gone, you made it disappear. Yeah. You, you did a good job. You guys are yes, proud. Yes, 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 George, yes. George, can you please come back? I would be honored to, thank you. There's so much we have to learn from you. There's a lot to fix in people's houses. I'm happy to help anytime. There's a lot to fix in life. There's a lot to fix in life. This yeah. Is well, thank you, George Oliphant, so much. George, for the rest of your streaming on Peacock. And the new season will premiere on March 26th on NBC.